How's it going dudes? Welcome back to the channel for another video on Street Fighter Duel. Now I've been getting lots of questions asking me just to show guides for the other tricky stages. There's, there's probably two um, that you could call tricky and these um, world quest stage things, I forget what they're called right now. But but the first one of the two that you might see that is a little bit tricky is Shad Blue Labyrinth. Um, it's got two main parts in here that are I suppose relatively um, tricky for people to handle. So I'm just going to go through it here, do a complete walkthrough, show you exactly how to go about getting past these little puzzles. Um, you've got to do the tiles in the right order or you will not be able to progress. So I am going to do this and we should be able to hopefully just fly our way through this. I was going to change my team but I don't think I should need to change my team. Um, a bit of a tip for these stages, if you're someone who is kind of struggling with them, what I would do is try your best, if you can, to take lifesteal. Lifesteal on these stages is extremely important because as you go through, you do not get a chance to replenish your health. So if you have got stages where you're taking lots of damage, then the things you want to do to progress is get energy through killing enemies. Now, if you were doing this, you would obviously take out all of these stages, okay? But I just kind of want to rush through this to get to the puzzles so that you guys can actually see what you need to do for the puzzles to get by. Now, this first one, I believe, is the first of the, the kind of trickier ones um, to get by. So we're going to go into that just now and I will walk you through exactly what you want to do to get past this stage, okay? So this is what you do. Go here, here. Here, 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 here. So this one was pretty simple, to be honest. Move on through here. Obviously, if you take out the two side stages, I think there's chests up there, I can't remember because it's been a while since I've, I've actually done this, but obviously, taking out all of those stages, you will be able to get access to all of your chests. Now, coming up here just now is the first of the two, I want to say more difficult of the stages, puzzles to get by. Um, this one is relatively taxing, but the next one I would say is actually a fair bit more difficult to figure out, okay? So this is your first of two that you want to get past. So if you look at this here, once I've done it, you might want to take a screenshot or whatever. Um, and we will walk through just now exactly how you go about doing that. Guys, I'm really rudely interrupting myself here to say, if you are new here, if you're looking for more Street Fighter Duel content, make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and come back for more. Right, so, this is what you do. Move to here, move to here, move to here, okay? Then, you move to here, to here, one to here, down, across, up, along, along, down, down. Right, this is where it gets a little bit tricky. I just need to remember what I'm doing here. Go to here, here, up, across, across, down. Then you go here, across, across, down, down, back on yourself, up, across, down, 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 across, up, across, down, across, across. And now you can see straight up to the path at the end. This has done the complete square, so that has now opened up that path. And for you, if it was your first time doing it, the volcano would go away and you would then have access to get to the little chest that's sitting up there. This next one coming up is a bit more taxing. Um, I don't know if there's more than one solution to this, but I've got a solution and that's the solution that I'm going to show you guys um, so that you guys can obviously make your way through here and get all of the chests in your first run through, making it nice and simple for you to clear. So, let's do this. So what you want to do first is you want to go all the way up to the end over here. Once you're at the end, you need to kind of zigzag on yourself a little bit by going down, across, and then back up. Once you've done that, you're going to go all the way along to this far end, okay? So you've reached the far end now. Now you're going to come down to this rock. Once you've reached this rock, you're going to come across, then you're going to go down, then you're going to go across, then you're going to go down, across. Right, at that point, you're going to come up just 
to one beyond this rock, okay? You're going to go across here, then you're going to fill in the gaps, you're going to come across here, across here, up, across, 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 which leads you to this section here, and you're going to fill out the basic top section here by doing this, okay? Now once you've done that, you're going to take one more step, okay? And then what you're going to basically be doing is going to be coming back on yourself, okay? So you're going to go down one more, and then you're going to cut in, right? Once you've cut in, you're going to come all the way down to the bottom, and that's you filled in quite a lot of that there, okay? So then you're going to come along here, parallel to this rock that you can see at the top, and then you're going to go back up and hit that rock. Then you're going to go across to the left, and at this point, we are going to be kind of filling in the gaps here. So you're going to go this way, bring yourself up to here, then you're going to come across, and you're going to come back down again, then across, and once you've done that, it's starting to get quite simple now, okay? You're going to come up, across, then once you've done that, you're going to come down, down, across, down, down, then you're literally going to be running on a zigzag pattern all the way until you get to the end and that is you completed it. The all paths are open, you're now able to claim every single chest, 100% clear, one run through of Shadlow Labyrinth. I don't think this one is quite as tricky as um, the Arctic Lake one, to be honest. It is still quite tricky. I think that they've made these deliberately more difficult than they have to be. Um, you're not here for a puzzle game, you're here for an idle fighting game. But that is it. Go through, collect everything that you can collect to make yourself more powerful. Walking into this last fight at that point should be pretty easy for you guys. Um, and then you will walk out of here with some nice tidy rewards from this little stage. So the next one we're going to tackle after this is going to be the... The other ice one, um, yeah, the other ice one. The other ice one can be a little bit of a pain in the arse, to be honest. Um, I might have actually put this out of order, I'm not sure, but I'll show you the other ice one. That'll be the next guide that I put up. There's only really one tricky puzzle in that other ice one, to be honest, so I don't know how many people will actually need it. But people have been asking me to do these, so I'm doing them. Mission complete, that's us. Make sure you go in, get your 100% completion. If you're new here, remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment, do all of that good stuff, because it helps me out a hell of a lot. Anyway guys, I've been Hazink, thank you very much for watching this video, and I will be back with more Street Fighter Duel content very, very soon indeed. Goodbye.